scene script. Ever wondered why some individuals bounce back from adversity while others crumble under the weight of their troubles? The secret lies in their thinking. Welcome to a journey into the heart of the human psyche where we will explore the profound power of a changed mindset. The mind, a fascinating entity, is the birthplace of our thoughts, beliefs and perspectives. It molds our reality, influencing how we perceive the world around us and consequently how we act in it. The power of the mindset is not a novel concept. It has been echoed through the ages, finding its place in ancient wisdom, modern psychology and the success stories of individuals who've defied odds. These individuals, often hailed as extraordinary, are simply ordinary people with an extraordinary mindset. Consider the inspiring journey of Bethany Hamilton, a professional surfer who lost her arm in a shark attack. She didn't let her physical condition dictate her future. Instead, she embraced a mindset of resilience and determination, returning to professional surfing and becoming a champion. Her changed mindset was her surfboard on the waves of adversity. Or think about Thomas Edison. His mindset of relentless curiosity and unwavering perseverance led him to invent the light bulb, despite a thousand failed attempts. He once said, I have not failed, I've just found 10,000 ways that won't work. His mindset transformed his failures into stepping stones towards success. In the words of the genius Albert Einstein, we cannot solve our problems with the same thinking we used when we created them. This statement speaks volumes about the power of our mindset. If we wish to overcome our challenges and reinvent our lives, we must first reinvent our thinking. So, let's embark on this transformative journey. It begins with a simple yet profound shift in perspective. A shift that can turn stumbling blocks into stepping stones, trials into triumphs, and problems into possibilities. Change your thinking and you change your world. So are you ready to change your world? But before we can change our thinking, we must first understand the barriers that hold us back. The labyrinth of the human mind is often fraught with roadblocks that deter us from our paths of self-improvement. These barriers are not physical impediments, but mental constructs, born out of fear, self-doubt and limiting beliefs. These internal roadblocks may seem insurmountable, but they are often nothing more than illusions of our own creation. Let's first consider fear. It's a primal emotion designed to protect us from danger. Yet in our modern world, fear often manifests itself in irrational ways, holding us back from the potential for growth. Renowned psychologist Carl Jung once said, what you resist persists. When we resist fear, we give it power over us, allowing it to persist and control our actions. Then there's self-doubt, a debilitating belief that we're not good enough, not capable enough, or simply unworthy. This can stem from past experiences, societal expectations, or even our own internal dialogue. It's a deceptive roadblock causing us to question our abilities and undermine our own success. And finally, we have limiting beliefs. These are the deep-seated convictions we hold about ourselves and the world around us. They're often rooted in our upbringing, culture or experiences, and they can shape our reality in profound ways. For instance, if we believe we're not capable of achieving something, we're likely to never even attempt it. These mental roadblocks, though formidable, are not permanent fixtures in our minds. They are mutable and can be broken down with awareness and understanding. As eminent psychologist Sigmund Freud once stated, being entirely honest with oneself is a good exercise. This honesty allows us to recognize these roadblocks for what they truly are, mere illusions. It empowers us to challenge our fears, confront our self-doubt, and question our limiting beliefs. Only by identifying these roadblocks can we begin to dismantle them. As we journey further into the realm of mindset transformation, remember that the first step towards change is awareness. And with awareness, we can begin the process of dismantling these barriers one thought at a time. So how do we change our thinking? It begins with embracing a new perspective. Perspective. It's a powerful tool, isn't it? It's the lens through which we view our world, coloring our thoughts, our actions, our very lives. But what if I told you that this lens is not fixed? That you have the power to adjust it, to shift it, to change it? Yes, your perspective is not a given, it's a choice. Now imagine standing at the edge of a vast, unending ocean. The waves are crashing, the wind is howling, and you feel insignificant against the enormity of it all. But then, you shift your perspective. 
You look down at the sand beneath your feet, at the tiny grains that make up the vast beach. Suddenly the ocean doesn't seem so overwhelming. You see, by changing your perspective, you've changed your experience. You might be wondering how can we apply this to our thinking? Well, it's quite simple. When we are faced with a problem, we often get stuck in a pattern of thinking, a pattern that is molded by our past experiences, our fears, our biases. But we can break free from this pattern. We can choose to see our problem from a different angle, to view it as an opportunity for growth, for learning. This concept is beautifully encapsulated in the biblical scripture, Romans 12. 2. Do not conform to the pattern of this world, but be transformed by the renewing of your mind. You see, the Bible understands the power of perspective. It encourages us not to be bound by the constraints of worldly thinking, but to rise above it, to renew our minds, to embrace a new perspective. So, the next time you find yourself stuck in a problem, remember the ocean and the grains of sand. Remember that your perspective is a choice. Choose to view your problem not as a mountain to be conquered, but as a stepping stone towards growth. A new perspective is the first step towards a changed mindset. Now that we understand the power of a changed mindset and the importance of perspective, let's discuss concrete strategies for changing your thinking. Firstly, mindfulness. It's not just a buzzword. Scientific studies show that mindfulness can help us to become more aware of our thoughts and feelings and manage them in a healthier way. Mindfulness is about paying attention to the present moment without judgment. It's like taking a step back and observing your own mind. This awareness gives us the power to choose how we respond to our thoughts rather than reacting impulsively. Next, positive affirmations. These are statements that promote positive thinking and self-empowerment. They might seem simple, but they have a profound impact. The American Psychological Association has published studies showing that repeating positive affirmations can actually change the way we think. So start each day by repeating a positive affirmation to yourself. You might be surprised at the difference it makes. Cognitive restructuring is another powerful tool. This involves identifying and challenging our negative thoughts. It's about changing the way we interpret events and experiences. Cognitive restructuring is often used in cognitive behavioral therapy, a type of therapy that's been proven effective for a range of mental health conditions. But remember, these strategies are not one size fits all. What works for one person might not work for another. It's about finding what works best for you and integrating it into your daily life. Finally, don't underestimate the power of seeking help. If you're struggling with negative thinking, it might be helpful to talk to a mental health professional. They can provide you with personalized strategies and support you in your journey towards a healthier mindset. Changing your thinking is not an overnight process. It takes time, effort and patience, but the rewards are worth it. A changed mindset can open up a world of possibilities. It can empower you to overcome challenges, achieve your goals and live a more fulfilling life. These strategies are your tools for building a new mindset. Changing your thinking is not a destination, but a journey. It's a journey that requires patience, consistency and belief in the process. It's a journey that asks you to let go of old patterns and embrace new perspectives. As the renowned thought leader Wayne Dyer once said, if you change the way you look at things, the things you look at change. The power of this statement lies in its simplicity. It's a gentle reminder that our perspective shapes our reality. This journey of changing your thinking is not about quick fixes or overnight transformations. It's about consistently choosing a new perspective over and over again. It's about being patient with yourself, understanding that change is a process, not an event. Remember the words of motivational speaker Les Brown, who said, you don't have to be great to get started, but you have to get started to be great. It's okay if you stumble or fall along the way. It's okay if progress seems slow. The important thing is that you're taking steps, no matter how small, towards changing your thinking. Embrace the wisdom of spiritual leader Deepak Chopra, who reminds us, all great changes are preceded by chaos. There may be moments of confusion or discomfort along this journey, but these moments are not obstacles. They are signs that you're on the right path, that you're breaking free from old patterns and stepping into a new way of thinking. Now let's turn to the teachings of the ancient sage Lao Tzu, who said, 
A journey of a thousand miles begins with a single step. You've taken that first step by choosing to change your thinking. Keep going, be patient, be consistent, and most importantly, believe in the power of your mind to shape your reality. Remember, the power to change your world lies within your mind. Start your journey today.